So today I'm going to be showing you how to set up a MetaMask wallet or just a crypto wallet on the Ethereum blockchain. So what you're going to want to do is go to type in MetaMask on Google or you know whatever you use. Click on that link. Once you do that, you're going to see this button you download for Chrome. If you have Chrome or if you're using Brave, you can do it there. Okay, so now we're on the setup phase. So what we're going to do is we're going to do create a wallet. I agree. Type in a password. Agree. Create. All right. So there's this neat little video, but you don't even need to watch this because you're watching this video. So then there's going to be a secret recovery phrase. You're going to click right here, and that'll show you your secret recovery phrase. Take a picture of it and make sure it's somewhere safe on your phone. But honestly, the safest way is to write it down. So I would write it down somewhere where you know you're not going to lose it. And then once you do that, press next. All right. So now it's going to make you put in the C phrase, which is what you just should have wrote down. All right. So you're going to do it in the order that it showed you. So when you write it down, it goes from left to right, top to bottom. All right. So once you did that, it'll say, congratulations, you passed the test, you know, blah, 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 all done. Now you have your Ethereum crypto wallet set up. If you want to add a new network, you're just going to go up to here, search like, we'll just do Binance Smart Chain. So Binance Smart Chain, MetaMask. And so this is the information that you're going to want to use. It's in the description below. Network name, Smart Chain, new RPC URL. That's just this. So you just copy chain ID 56, currency symbol BNB, block explorer is this BS scan. Now for Ethereum, you would be on Etherscan. This is Binance's version of that. So there we go. You got Binance. It's already set up. Smart chain. All right, you guys. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, please like and subscribe. Look for more of these tutorial slash how-to videos.